Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I will be showing today how you can make these beautiful orchids. They are very easy and fast to make. So stay tuned for the step by step. Okay, for this project, I will be using this yarn. It's 100% cotton, it's pork weight, but you can use any GK or baby light triply yarn. And we also need uh, one stem, wire, scissors, pliers, a little bit of stuffing, hot glue gun, a 2.75 millimeters and a three millimeters crochet hook. We are going to start uh, with the petals and we need 15. And I will start by making a slip knot on the hook and then we are going to chain 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Beginning in the second chain from the hook, make one single crochet, half double crochet in the next, and then we are going to make double crochets. One, two, three, four, and five. Half double crochet in the next uh, chain. And in the last chain, we are going to make a total of three single crochets. One, two, three, and three. Working in the opposite side, make one half double crochet. Then five double crochets. One, two, three, four, and five. Half double crochet in the next. One single crochet here in the last stitch available, and we are going to make one single crochet here in the next loop. Now we're going to change the hook to the three millimeters to work the last round, and from the last single crochet, we go to the to this one here, and we're going to make one single crochet. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight single crochets. In the next stitch, we are going to make one increase. One increase in the next stitch. And one more increase here. Okay, we are going to make increases in the three single crochets we did in the last uh, chain in the previous round. Now continue making single crochets here. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, and eight single crochets. We're going to make a slip stitch on top of the next stitch here. One chain. And we are going to hide this end.
for the leaves. We are going to make a total of 15 chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen chains. And we are going to place the wire between the hook and the yarn. And beginning in the second chain from the hook, we are going to make a single crochet. In the next stitch, make one half double crochet. Then we are going to make double crochets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine um, double crochets. In the next stitch, we're going to make one half double crochet, one single crochet in the next, and in the last chain, we are going to make a total of three single crochets. One, two, and three. Start in the first stitch here, make one single crochet one half double crochet and then we're going to make a nine double crochets I have nine double crochets in the next stitch make one half double crochet in the last stitch one single crochet then slip a stitch to join. And we can cut the turn. You can add only one of these leaves or two. I have the green one. And I will make one more. It's the same pattern, but changing uh, the color in the last two rounds. We are going to start by making one magic circle. One chain. And into the magic circle, we are going to make a total of six single crochets. Have two, three, four, five, and six close the magic circle a slip stitch on top of the first uh, single crochet made for the number two we are going to make a total of six increases and we are going to be hiding the, this tail along the way make one increase in the first stitch go to the next Make one increase. And you're going to continue making four more increases. A slip a stitch to join and make sure you have 12 stitches. For the number three, four, and five, we are going to be making one single crochet in each stitch. Continue working in the round number three, four, and five. I have one, two, three, four, five, and six uh, rounds. For the number seven, I will change color. I will finish the slip stitch joining the green color here. Make 
and I will make this round um, making one single crochet in each stitch you just continue making one single crochet in each stitch A slip stitch to join for the last round chain one skip the first stitch go to the second one and make one single crochet and this is going to count as the first uh, decrease now we're going to make decreases all the way to the end taking the front loop of the two stitches A slip stitch to join and we are going to leave enough yarn to cover the stem and you're going to follow the same process for the green one for the center we are going to make one magic circle one, two empty chains and we are going to make a total of three double crochets one two three one two and three chains make one slip stitch into the magic circle then make one two three and four chains yarn over twice and make one triple crochet we're going to make a total of three triple crochets one two three and four and make one um slip stitch into the magic circle one two and three chains and we're going to make three double crochets one two three one two and three chains and we're going to make one slip stitch into the magic circle one chain and we can cut the turn okay we're going to leave this here and with yellow color we are going to make one magic circle chain two and then we're going to make 10 double crochets into the magic circle one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten close the magic circle Pass this end here to this side and make the slip stitch on top of the first double crochet made. One chain. Then we are going to bring this end here. Okay, make a knot here and then we are going to cut the turn Thank you. 
we're going to grab the wire pass it through the first part and then here in the yellow one add the hot glue and then bring this together Hot glue here in the bottom, and we are going to place the second part like this. Okay, we are going to add hot glue here. We are going to place it like this here. Add hot glue to the next petal and place it right in front of the first one like this. The next petal is going to be like this here. And I am adding the hat glue here where we did end the round. Then the last one. We are going to place it here. And we are going to let it dry. Okay, next for this part, add enough hot glue here. Insert the wire and press and let it dry. Now for this one, we are going to wrap the stem here, start by adding enough glue to the, this part. And we are going to wrap the, the stem. Okay, we are going to start assembling the flower. We are going to place the green one first. Then we are going to add the this one.
and start adding the flowers. Thank you so much for watching my videos. Don't forget to subscribe, give us a like, and share on your social media. And I hope the process was clear to you. Any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Thank you and have a wonderful day.